quick, easy video on how to upgrade or <coughs> make your instant noodles a bit better with, uh, I think it's three or four, it makes your, make your instant noodles like more normal, but also add a few extra ingredients. We didn't learn how to call your ramen. It doesn't matter which ramen you can use, you can use any instant noodles. I prefer Koyo and separate Ichiban, but you can use pretty much any. While your ramen is cooking, you can get some <coughs> tofu. I prefer to use this kind. You can even use small tofu. But I don't really like that stuff, so. Just sticking with this, you're gonna grab a knife. And then just get the chopping. Uh, don't use the whole thing, obviously. Cut like, I would say half of it, depending on how much you're making. So I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use half of it for this video, or maybe possibly even less, but. Wrapped up your tofu, and this is the part that I'm gonna set aside. So I'm not using half of it, so I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna grab a container, and I'm just gonna put it. Unfortunately, I am all out, so we're just gonna stick with the tofu. So, once you've chopped up your tofu, <laughs> that was an accident. And just the tofu. And then put it into your ready made ramen. And just make sure you have clean hands, unless you're just gonna use a knife because that's kind of like. Tofu on my Okay, yeah, that's it. So that's all the tofu done. Now to add the um I also don't have sesame oil, I was gonna add sesame oil, but I think I'm out. probably thinking she's gonna get something. Oh now we're going to add the chili oil. Uh, I like to use this brand. You can use any brand, but I prefer this is all optional, by the way. And just pour in a, that's probably too much, but just a bit of that's actually quite a lot. Just a bit, add a bit of kick to your uh, ramen, and that's pretty much it. So if you have enjoyed. Um, and want some more tutorials like this, uh, make sure to subscribe and like the video and the channel. And I will see you in the next one. Also, my usual cameraman or other guy here, he's upstairs doing, I don't know. So, it's just me. Anyways, see you in the next video. And here's the final result. Just, uh, to show you guys, doesn't that look delicious? Now you can also add green onion and sesame oil. I was going to, but was out of both. And I haven't had time to run to the store because I was just recording this pretty much instantly. So subscribe and like the video for more tutorials like this. See you in the next video again.